Hi, Melty. Hi. Oh, you look so blue. The light in the dark. Hello, hello, Milton baby. Hello, hello. Hi. morning I don't know why the camera's so blue today anyways uh, so the reason why the shot started the way it did is because I remembered I needed to start vlogging today but the camera was in the car so I went to get the um, the camera and then every time I come back Milton is always there she's always waiting she's the sweetest um, so today is Friday and actually Andy and I have the day off today so we we're supposed to just hang out at home hang out with the girls we'll see how that goes we never really take a day off for example, we're vlogging today, so although it's very light work and it's fun, it's still work. Hmm? Hi, Milton. Hi, hi, Hi. Hi. So it's rare that I show you guys what I make for breakfast, but today, since it's a day off, it's like a weekend, I'm making breakfast sandwiches. So we have sausage rounds, going to have eggs, English muffins, fake cheese. It's going to be so good. Hello. Hello, friends. You still in bed? I'll stay in bed for a long time. Today. <laughs> he likes to stay in bed very long on the weekends. And today is a weekend. Eh? nothing in here that's really homemade everything is like bought except like the eggs but it tastes so much more homemade and less commercial than the McDonald's one for example mm -hmm. maybe because it's home assembled mm. Mm. I need to cut mine in half why first. why because it makes for better bites really you understand oh you like animals. corners yes mm. Sorry guys, I just climbed out of bed. I am not fit for a camera right now. But I have to eat this hot. Mmm. Look at her. Lucky, <laughs> okay, are you ready to pounce? Oh my god, look how beautiful it looks. Mmm. Breakfast sandwich homemade. Mmm. Oh, how good. This American cheese is like, did you guys ever wonder why it could stay in the fridge for like a year and never go bad? Like, it can't be good for you. It's fake cheese. We call it fake cheese. Processed. Extremely processed. Mm. <clears throat> oh, she gave up. She's pretending like she doesn't want it. <laughs> All right. Happy mm. breakfast. So we're currently having an internal debate. I think I'm going to dip mine with a side of ketchup and Andy wants mustard with his. What would you guys eat it with? Tell us friends, comment below. Breakfast this, sandwich, ketchup or mustard? This already has some mayo in it. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead with ketchup. Mustard. You guys think that Herky and Milton would enjoy this tiny piece of egg? Oh, they can't. There's onion powder. Bail. Maybe a, a bit of your English muffin. Mm. 
Reminder that onion is not good for dogs, guys. You want to try a bit of English muffin, Milton? Because you're an English dog? Are you an English dog? Her tail is so cute. That's how she gets everything. Mm. Eyes and tails and eyes. Her keep begging eyes. Oh my gosh, she's so beautiful. That's a big shot of the garbage. That's where Mil Milton decided to position herself. Besides the garbage can. Real sexy, Milton. Look, she's smiling. Hey, Lana, I wanted to talk to you. I wanted to talk to you about important things. What you doing today? Hey, Lana, I can schedule, do are you doing important business and importing baby business? Herky, we see Herky. Come on, Herky. Herky. Them to Herky. See Herky. Let's get them Herky. Tu dis pas grand chose aujourd'hui, bébé. Oui. Bonjour. Et là, c'est qui? Oui, c'est Herky. Like you again. Her, her face agrees. Okay, guys, quick rant for our Canadian and non Canadian friends. Who here is Canadian and knows what Timbits are? Who here love Timbits? If you're American or international friends of ours, the next time that you visit Canada, you should really try some Timbits. It's like the national Canadian donut. And you know what? Tim, why Timbits are fun? Because they're actually like little munchkins and they have a new flavor out called Fruit Loops. It tastes like actual Fruit Loops. Let's see if that's a Fruit Loop. That's not a Fruit Loop. This is a par party cake. Uh, stop calling it party cake. Try that's it. What they call it. I think this will be Fruit Loops. It's not, it's not birthday cake? Mmm. Fruit Loops? Mm. Mmm, Fruit Loop. Oh my god. Feels it's, like childhood. It's so for real Fruit Loops and there's actual Fruit Loops in here. Mmm, Fruit Loop. <coughs> so we ate almost all of it already. Since yesterday, okay? Mmm. Milton loves sweets. So once again, guys, Timbits, if you come visit Camden. I don't personally like Tim Hortons, but you know. Me either. I just like Timbits. Mm. Ah, oh, Milton, what's this? What's this? Oh, we got a new package. All right, let's go see what's in this package. So, you guys know we've been using Big Country Raw for a while now. Uh, a year, I would say. We've been on Raw for two years, almost three years, I think. And they just dropped off this package. You guys know that we uh, were big believers in raw food. I know Big Country Raw is only available in Canada, but um, for those of you who are outside of Canada, I do like Primal and Small Batch in the U.S. Uh, yes, Herky, you're sitting right there. All right, so let's see what Big Country Raw sent us. Ooh, what's all this? All right, so this is very exciting. Okay, I'm going to let you guys sniff for a while. All right, let's see. So I see two sort of licky mats. But this is from Messy Messy Mutt. So it's the same principle as the Licky Mutt, but we're not gonna have extra now. So there's this one, and hold on, I saw another one. This one, fun, very fun paper. Okay, this is very exciting. You guys know we supplement the girls' food with fish oil every day. And this is brand new from Thrive. Thrive is also sold on Big Country Raw's website. And this is salmon oil. that's new wait wait Milton and this is fun it's a new water bottle that I guess you can use for your dog or for yourself yeah see there's a water bottle and a bowl for your pup on excursions it's always good to have extra water Milton's gonna go in the box it won't be long Milton 
Can I help you? Excuse me. Can I open it? Okay, hold on. Let's see what else you have. Okay, let's see what else you have. Sit down. Sit, baby. That's good. What's this? So I'm guessing dog muffin baking kit. Oh, this is fun. Milton, we're going to make you some muffins. We're going to make you some muffins. Okay. All right, and then we got, I guess, a refill of our favorite treats. Slobbers. These are the peanut butter ones. Chicken necks. We like to add these to the girls' bowls once in a while. Oh my gosh, she's in the box. There she goes. These are lake smells. These are little fishes that are dehydrated. See, the girls are very excited. Oh, and Trek. This is really fun. Trek is some dehydrated raw. So when you go camping or you're on a trip and you can't bring your raw, you just bring this and then you can just add some sort of... Herky, can I help you? You can just add some sort of fluid to it and it rehydrates your raw. This one. So I'm just done the unboxing. I was putting stuff away. Herky and Milton decided to use the box as a place to hang out. What do you guys think? Don't they look like little kittens? They just look like little cats. You're oh never, my god, there's no more carpet. You would never sit on the floor there. Nope. So, where are you taking my carpet? So, I'm playing right now. It's my day off. So I'm playing redecoration. So we're redoing the office, or we're completing the office. Since we moved in, everything has kind of been like just dumped in there and we never took the time to do it properly and we didn't have the budget for it. But now that we have a bit of day time off, we're gonna redo the office. So what we're gonna do guys is this whole wall here, we're gonna have a guy from Ikea come and do like shelving for this entire wall. It's not shelving, it's two bestas. It's two bestas, so yeah, it is shelving. It's like closed shelving. It's gonna go almost to the ceiling. It's two storage units. And then we're gonna have a new desk where me and Mai are gonna be sharing. I'm not sure how it's gonna work out, but now. But it's a big L shape, it's an L shaped desk. And it's a standing desk, so you can move it up and down, and it's a big L. And then here we have some this is space for now. Yeah, and all that is going to go in the storage units. And right now we're shopping for a carpet. So we're testing it in the rug of one here to see if we're going to like having a big carpet. Let's go. I'm watching you. You guys could tell us, do you prefer carpet or no carpet for the office? I'm thinking some sort of like whitish or beige uh, color because it's going to be lighter for the eye. And in the winter when you work, it's going to feel better on the feet. You guys like this? Or is it too homey? Mai, what is your feedback? Did you just call me Mai? Yes. It's weird. Oh, Herky! At the same time, it could be an extra playroom for Herky and Milton. Oh, Herky Milton! Oh my god, your carpet's here, puppies! Ruggable, if you're watching, we want a sponsorship for Herky and Milton. Send us what you think would look best for Herky and Milton's fur. Look, she got spooked. <laughs> look. Wait, wait. Herky never spilled on command. Spilled Herky. Spilled it out. Spilled it out. So do you like having a carpet in the office? Yeah, but as long as like our chairs are gonna rub on here and stuff. It's gonna be on it. Or we, we pull back everything and then the chairs are gonna be more... Well, I would like having the chair on it because then I could touch this with my feet. I know, but... Oh, no, she's not doing it. Know what I mean? Like, as long as it's completely on or completely off, but if it just keeps judging on and off all the time, it's not good for the corners. What do you think, Herky? Should we have a smaller carpet or the big carpet? Do you know, Milton? Carpets are so cool. What would you guys prefer? Small or big? She's <laughs> like, what do we want, Milton? Which color? Beige? Blue? White? What do you like? Her is so cute. She likes purple the most. So guys, let me give you a little touch-up review on the Dyson. Up to now, I really like it. Like, now that we had it for a week, 
See, like a perfect situation like this. I move a bench or a car. Uh, I mean, I move a chair or a carpet, and there's a bit of fur right, right, right there. As you dog owners would know. Now we can just take this out, and I really like the small tip one. This is what we have on permanently. So then you can just, you know, take it out. No need for wires, and wrap it up real quick. And just for like little things like this, see when there's like a little bit of dust, you don't feel like really vacuuming. Perfect time for the bison. Meanwhile, mom is making her kid and Milton work outside. They are earning their food. They think they're in the picture, but they're not. <laughs> they're not. So I'm done shooting content with the girls. Then I went inside and they're still just out there chilling. We've been talking for like 15 minutes inside. I know, what you girls doing? We're done working. <laughs> so good. They're carting their food? Yep. All right, it's already lunchtime and got some leftover fried rice that it's essential you re-pan fry. Now look at those crispy bits. Ooh, it's so hot still. Those crispy bits is essential when you eat fried rice. And my favorite, you add some sriracha, some Maggi sauce, and it's delish. Bon appétit! Hergie, where are we? I wonder if Milton would be friends with the duck and want to eat it. She don't want to eat it. Get to Milton's belly. Milton, you like to talk to the duck? It's so funny when they have the butt. So we just parked at this park besides the river that's like about 12 minutes from our house and we're gonna discover it for the first time. Herky, how do you like this park up till now? It's so small there's nothing to do. Poop, 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 poop. Ah, 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 so much poop. Yeah, I think we're gonna go on the bicycle path. There's way too much burp poo here. Okay, no! I'm here so many fat or Canada. It connected this to Saint Jean. This is history. Hi, Herky. I wonder if that old house was there since the beginning. Maybe. All right, so we have a mango tango smoothie, orange slush with soft serve. She wants to come up. <laughs> she wants to come up. That's dangerous. That's dangerous, Milton. Up or no? So I'm eating with my friend here. Kirky, you can't taste any of this. This tastes nothing like Joe's Italian ice. It's in the open, but it will do for now. How is yours? It's, it's, it's just a smoothie. Okay. Milton is very cute beside you. This is my favorite part of walking Hurricane Milton. Quiet, sleepy dogs.
All right, it's smoky hazy in the house because you know I used the cast iron on the pizza. Here is what she looks like. It's a bit different than the one we usually make. This one has pepperoni. It has a rustic homemade tomato sauce and a lot of different herbs on it. Does she look nice? Beautiful. Beautiful. And we have a special tonight. It must be my birthday. <laughs> he is making burgers. So what we got? We got some pickles. He's gonna try to recreate Goldberger from LA basically. We have our own aioli. aioli. Here we're gonna have some onions. Smash burger style. You know we need American cheese. Pickles. I'm excited. And he's gonna do that on the griddler. Smash burger style. All right. Oh, here's another angle of the beautiest of a pizza. Okay, so I'm making a double patty burger. We ran out of cheese, but we took one patty, split it into two to make two thinly smashed patties that's gonna be crunchy. We're gonna put some onions on there. We're gonna add some salt before we smash them. We don't have a smasher, so we're gonna use this mm, to squeeze it down. We're gonna go cast iron, and then we have some brioche bread that Mai is gonna do on the griddler just to get this side here Toasty. nice and crunchy. And oh. the top, still soft. Very excited. Kind of looks like Goldberg. Aioli. Voila! Moment of truth. You first. You're the lady. Alright. This looks like a messy burger, not gonna lie. I'm gonna bite right here. I understand nothing of what you're saying. Milk and structure acid. Not gonna lie, this is very reminiscent of Goldberger. Sorry. <laughs> I only. A bit issue. messy there, Bobby? Uh huh. They're very messy. They're very good. It's very good. Is it the best burger you've had in your house? Yes, definitely. That's very impressive for a homemade thing. The onion looks nicely grilled. Double cheese. Mmm. Right? Mm, pretty good. Like, for a homemade, this is like really, really good. Definitely the best we've had in the house. It's good for anything. Yeah. It's a bit rich. We put too much butter. I think too much butter on the buns, maybe. Too much mayo. Maybe. But it's very good. Mmm. It's really good. I could have gotten less pickle. But. Yeah, terrific. Alright guys, we're gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching and coming along. We'll see you next time. Bye. Say bye. Say bye. Bye bye.